Hey guys, how you doing? RBP from Monolith here and another Model Blab coming your way. Today, I'm gonna to talk about endorsements with you guys. I get a ton of questions about endorsements and how to get them, uh, what to do when you have them and so on. I'm sitting here on my beautiful Sonar SQ2 kit. It's a custom made kit by Sonar that they built for me. I have one here in North America and then I got another one in uh, UK, in England, London, England, waiting for me for when I can hopefully go back on tour soon enough. But uh, endorsements, let's, let's get into it guys. Basically, this is the advice that I would give you guys. Get your shit together. In other words, if you're gonna have a bunch of endorsements that you wanna go over, make sure you have videos of yourself playing the gear. Make sure you have pictures of yourself playing the gear. Make sure you're already posting stuff about the gear that you love from them, okay? That's what they're gonna look for. The next thing they're gonna look for, are you in the public eye? Are you touring? Are you a teacher that has, you know, 100 students and is very popular on YouTube? A lot of people think, oh, I'm just gonna get a whole bunch of YouTube followers and I'll get endorsements. Yes, that can happen nowadays, but honestly, what they really care about is the whole package. Do you have a YouTube account? Are you putting videos out? Are you touring? That's one of the biggest things they love, is that you're touring and playing in front of a bunch of people. That's the biggest thing, guys, is getting in front of the public eye as much as possible. And of course, having people who follow you, whether it's through your band or on YouTube, social media, whichever. Okay, once you get these endorsements, so here's the other thing to it. It's not about taking, taking, taking. It's about taking and giving back. For example, if you guys follow me on my social media, I'm constantly posting stuff about the gear I play. Uh, pictures in different venues I played all around the world, videos of uh, different touring scenarios that I've had, you know, the past 18 years of my career. All these things are very important because you're giving back and you're promoting the gear that you're endorsing. And these companies love that. It's a two-way road, guys. It's not about taking, getting an endorsement, thinking you're gonna get a bunch of free shit. And to be honest, there isn't a ton of free shit anymore when it comes to endorsements. So just be happy you get an endorsement and that you get a discount or whichever. Yes, you can get some free stuff, but uh, you gotta be doing it a long time and you better have a big following. But uh, that's pretty much my insight towards endorsements, guys. It's all about being in that public eye. It's all about promoting it. And your reps will love you when you get an endorsement. And it's the best way to go. That's my two cents on it. I could talk an hour about this topic, but honestly, uh, if you really want to go about getting endorsements, there's a good starting tutorial video for you. All right, from this uh, Amano Lab. So stay posted, there'll be another Amano Lab soon. Hope you guys are doing well. Take care out there, COVID-19, some crazy shit, man. But uh, make the most of it. Have a great day, guys. Amano Lab!